Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factor by grouping. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 9mz minus 4nc plus 3mc minus 12nz, and we want to factor this completely. Well, I'm going to actually rearrange this and try to put similar uh, terms together. I'm going to bring down my 9mz here, and I see, well, this m, they both have an m here, and they both 3 and 9, uh, 3 goes into 9 pretty evenly. So I'm going to bring that down, 3mc. I then am going to put my 12nz, uh, but I'm going to make it a plus and minus instead of minus here, plus a negative, 12nz, and bring down the last part, again, plus a negative, 4nc. They both have an n in it, and 4 goes into both of them. So now we're going to pull out a like term here. The first half here, both of them have a 3. 3 goes into 9, 3 goes into 3, and they both have an m in them. If I pull out a 3m, I'm left with a 3z plus, well, just 1c. I'm not going to do that again with the second two numbers. A negative 4 is in both parts, as well as an n. If I pull out a negative 4n in both of these, I'm left with a 3z plus c. And make sure you keep the negatives and positives in line. We're pulling out a negative 4n. Well, I have a 3z plus c and 3z plus c written twice right here. Pull that out from both parts, right? 3z plus c, and I'm left with this. 3m minus 4n, bringing that down. And now we actually have our final answer. 3z plus c times 3m minus 4n. I hope this video is helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minutemathtutor.com